The Deadly Speed of Bullets An Introduction Bullets They are small, often made of metal, and are designed to be fired from a gun. These small projectiles are often made of dense metals like lead or copper, and they are meticulously designed to be fired from various types of firearms. But what makes them so dangerous? It's their speed. When a bullet is fired, it travels at an astonishing velocity. Bullets travel incredibly fast, much faster than most things we see in our everyday lives. This speed is what makes them so lethal. We're talking hundreds, even thousands of miles per hour. To put it in perspective, some bullets can travel faster than the speed of sound. This incredible velocity is what gives bullets their power, their ability to cause serious harm. The impact of a bullet can be devastating. Think about a car speeding down the highway. Now imagine that car moving many times faster. That's how fast a bullet can travel. It's almost unimaginable, but it's a reality. The speed at which a bullet travels is a testament to the engineering and physics behind its design. It's a scary thought, but it's important to understand the reality of bullet speed. This knowledge is crucial for safety and awareness. This incredible speed is a result of carefully engineered forces and physics. The science behind it is both fascinating and complex. It's a testament to human ingenuity, but it's also a stark reminder of our capacity for destruction. The duality of creation and destruction is ever-present. The science behind bullet speed is fascinating and complex, but it's crucial to grasp the basics. Understanding these principles can lead to better safety practices. Why? Because understanding how bullets work, how fast they travel, and the damage they can inflict is vital for responsible gun ownership and for informed discussions about gun control. This essay will delve into the world of bullets, exploring their speed, design, and the science behind their deadly potential. We will look at the mechanics and the physics that make bullets so effective. We'll uncover the factors that influence their velocity and the different types of bullets designed for specific purposes. Each type has its own unique characteristics and uses. Most importantly, we'll emphasize the importance of respecting the power of firearms and the need for responsible gun use. Understanding and respect are key to safety. Imagine a bullet being fired from a gun. The sheer force and speed at which it exits the barrel is nothing short of astonishing. The moment it leaves the barrel, it's propelled forward with incredible force, almost as if it's defying gravity. That initial burst of speed, the speed at which the bullet exits the gun, is called muzzle velocity. This is a critical factor in understanding the dynamics of a fired projectile. It's a fundamental concept in ballistics, the study of projectiles in motion. Ballistics experts spend countless hours analyzing this data to improve accuracy and performance. Muzzle velocity is measured in feet per second or meters per second. These measurements help in comparing different firearms and ammunition. It can vary significantly depending on a range of factors, including the type of firearm, the ammunition used, and even environmental conditions like temperature and humidity. A small .22 caliber bullet fired from a handgun might have a muzzle velocity of around 1,000 feet per second, which is relatively low compared to larger calibers, while a larger .308 caliber bullet fired from a high-powered rifle can reach speeds exceeding 3,000 feet per second, showcasing the immense power of such firearms. Why is muzzle velocity so important? It's not just about speed, it's about the overall performance of the bullet, because it directly affects the bullet's trajectory, range, and ultimately, its impact on a target. Higher speeds mean flatter trajectories and longer ranges. A higher muzzle velocity means the bullet will travel farther, faster, and with greater energy, making it more effective in reaching distant targets. This translates to increased potential for damage, as the bullet retains more energy upon impact. Understanding muzzle velocity is key to understanding the power of firearms. It's a measure of the raw energy unleashed when a gun is fired. It's a measure of the raw energy unleashed when a gun is fired, and it underscores the need for caution and responsibility when handling these weapons. And it underscores the need for caution and responsibility when handling these weapons. Proper training and respect for the power of firearms are essential for safety. We know that muzzle velocity is the speed of a bullet as it leaves the gun barrel. This is a critical factor in understanding the performance and effectiveness of firearms. But what determines how fast a bullet will travel? What are the underlying principles that govern this speed? Several factors come into play, all working together to influence the bullet's initial speed. These factors are both mechanical and chemical in nature. First, we have the type of gunpowder used in the cartridge. 
The composition and quality of the gunpowder are crucial. Gunpowder is a chemical propellant that, when ignited, rapidly expands and produces hot gas. This gas is what drives the bullet forward. This gas creates immense pressure inside the cartridge, propelling the bullet forward with great force. Different types of gunpowder burn at different rates, producing varying amounts of gas and pressure. This variation can significantly affect the bullet's speed. More powerful gunpowder formulations can generate higher pressures, resulting in increased muzzle velocity. This is why high-powered rifles often use specialized gunpowder. Next, we have the amount of gunpowder used. The quantity of gunpowder in the cartridge is another critical factor. It seems intuitive that more gunpowder would equal a faster bullet. However, there are limits to this principle, and in general that's true. But too much gunpowder can also cause excessive pressure, which might damage the firearm. A larger gunpowder charge means more gas is produced, leading to higher pressure behind the bullet and consequently, a greater muzzle velocity. This balance is key to optimizing performance, but it's not just about the gunpowder. The bullet itself plays a crucial role in determining the muzzle velocity. The bullet's weight, shape, and material all influence how it behaves when fired. A heavier bullet requires more force to accelerate. A heavier bullet requires more force to accelerate, so it will generally have a lower muzzle velocity than a lighter bullet fired from the same gun with the same gunpowder charge. This is a fundamental principle of physics. Think of it like pushing a shopping cart versus pushing a car. The car, being heavier, requires significantly more force to get moving. The car, being heavier, requires more force to get moving. Similarly, a heavier bullet needs more force to achieve the same speed as a lighter one. Finally, the length of the gun barrel is another critical factor. The barrel length affects how long the bullet is subjected to the expanding gases. A longer barrel provides more space for the expanding gas from the gunpowder to exert force on the bullet. This allows the bullet to accelerate for a longer period. This prolonged acceleration results in a higher muzzle velocity. The bullet can reach its maximum potential speed. A shorter barrel, on the other hand, means the bullet exits the barrel sooner before it can reach its full potential velocity. This is why handguns typically have lower muzzle velocities compared to rifles. Bullets come in various shapes and sizes, each crafted with a specific purpose in mind. From hunting to self-defense, and even sport shooting, the design intricacies play a crucial role in their effectiveness. Understanding these differences helps us appreciate the engineering marvel behind each round. The path a bullet takes is a fascinating dance with physics. Factors such as gravity, air resistance, and even the Coriolis effect influence its trajectory. By analyzing these elements, we gain a deeper insight into the science that governs a bullet's flight. It's essential to recognize the inherent dangers associated with bullets. Their speed and power can cause significant harm, making safety measures and responsible handling paramount. Awareness and education are key to preventing accidents and ensuring safe usage. With great power comes great responsibility. As users of firearms, it's our duty to handle them with the utmost care and respect. By promoting responsible practices and continuous education, we can contribute to a safer environment for everyone.